Armorock is a totally corrosion-proof manhole rehabilitation system that helps you stop the corrosion cycle in sewer manholes. Armorock inserts are made from resin, sand, and rock, all of which are impervious to H2S, hydrogen sulfide. Our patented innovative design and installation process will save you time and money and add decades to the life of your sewer manholes. Polymer concrete material properties are 15,000 PSI in compression and 2,500 PSI in tensile strength. Fiberglass rebar reinforcement is also used when required because of its strength and corrosion resistant properties. Polymer concrete has been used in wastewater applications for more than 50 years. Sewer manhole rehabilitation using Armorock structural inserts is a cost-effective, environmentally sustainable, permanent solution to the corrosion in sewers caused by H2S. Unlike coatings and liners which simply act like a band-aid over the problem, an Armorock structural insert builds and fortifies the manhole, creating a solid, corrosion-proof structure inside the old one. This rehab system eliminates the cost and inconvenience of manhole removal and, with a 50-year corrosion warranty, engineers and owners can sleep well at night knowing the corrosion problems are eliminated in these manholes from here forward because of Armorock and your leadership to specify a sustainable material. As you can see in this video, manhole corrosion is common in the structure where it is exposed to H2S gas. In an H2S environment, structural corrosion is a foregone conclusion when using a Portland cement concrete even with topical solutions like coatings. Only Armorock offers a 100% corrosion-proof structure that lasts and you can count on for the design life of your collection line. By specifying Armorock, you stop the cycle of rehabilitation in your lines and create a future without costly corrosion rehab. Armorock is a precast product, meaning that the corrosion-proof properties are all the way through the structure and don't depend on human application of a coating or liner to provide corrosion protection over a corrodible material. Armorock has eliminated the material that H2S corrodes, even the steel that will corrode with water or H2S gas. In this quick demonstration video, traditional concrete is on the left and Armorock's polymer concrete is on the right. We dipped each product in 20% acid. You can see how Armorock is completely non-reactive in this acid. H2S gas in manholes creates H2SO4, sulfuric acid, and corrodes traditional concrete like the sample reacting on the left. Take a closer look and you can see the number four fiberglass rebar in the center of the polymer concrete. Yes, even corrosion-proof reinforcement in Armorock. Manholes that have been identified for rehabilitation are measured for the appropriate diameter and height of riser sleeves and cone or flat top required to reconstruct the manhole. One of the benefits of Armorock is that the inserts are modular, so adjustments in the field are very easy to do as unknowns arise in field construction. The rehabilitation process starts by removing the cone from the structure. Minimal digging is required. This is the only disruption to the street or ground. Many sewer lines do not need to be bypassed to rehabilitate the barrels and the cones. That saves the owner time and money. Once the cone, grade rings, and cover are removed, the riser sections are exposed. At this point, a cleaning process using a jet vac truck or power washer is recommended to ease the installation of the sleeve. After the manhole is power washed, typically the bench needs to be rebuilt according to the requirements of the owner. This can be done by using a 20-minute quick-set grout. Then, using best practices, a 2-inch overlay of polymer concrete is recommended. Other coatings can be used for the bench, but they do not add a lifespan as polymer concrete does. Once the bench has been prepared and leveled, an Armorock polymer concrete structural sleeve is lowered down into the old structure. This sleeve is then grouted and sealed in place. Many bases will require a custom cut in order to fit over existing pipes. This fitting is easily done with a concrete cutoff saw. The contractor on site will measure the manhole, then cut and shape the manhole sleeve in order to make the best fit. The cutting of an Armorock sleeve does not change the corrosion-proof material properties. Polymer concrete is corrosion-proof throughout the matrix. Then the next sleeve is stacked using the alignment guide and joint sealant between the inserts. The red arrow indicates where a hole was cut into the polymer sleeve to receive a lateral. 
Armorock sleeves can be cut or cored just as if you were using traditional concrete. No special tools are required to cut polymer concrete. Once the hole is in alignment with the incoming lateral, use Armorock grout for sealing up the hole or surface to create a corrosion-proof seal. This process continues until the inserts are at the appropriate height and then is finished with a flat top or a cone, depending on local specifications and requirements. Remember, Armorock does not depend on a worker to apply, prepare, or perform in order to create a corrosion-proof barrier. Armorock is corrosion-proof because of the materials. No human error or excuses for Armorock not being 100% corrosion resistant. To finish the application, a one-sack slurry ready mix or wet sand is poured down between the new inserts and the old manhole to fill the void. A new corrosion-proof structure has now been installed inside your existing structure that has a 50-year corrosion-proof warranty. You now have a legacy product and asset that will not require any maintenance, rehabilitation or tax dollars in the future. Come and be part of the future today. Join the Armor Rock Revolution and stop the corrosion rehabilitation cycle in your collection lines. Specify new Armor Rock polymer manholes or rehabilitation inserts today.